Hello and welcome to Teach Me Money Methods. In this video, I've got a really, really awesome uh, Canva alternative to share with you. It's called Pixelide. And if you at any point are interested in, in checking this offer out, the offer actually goes away on AppSumo in 20 hours. So this is a lifetime deal offer and it goes away in just 20 uh, hours. I'm inside the dashboard and I'm gonna show you what it can do. It's very powerful and it's a really good alternative. And the coolest part about this is, is that it will do pretty much everything that Canva will do. And even the user interface is pretty similar to Canva. But the cool part is I know a lot of you don't like to pay for monthly subscriptions and in order to uh, get all the features that Canva offers, you do have to pay about $13 a month for the premium plan. And when you look at that, uh, it's 13 uh, times 12. So you're looking at $156 per year that you're going to spend on Canva. And that's what I'm spending right now. And that is my go-to. That's how I use my, to create my YouTube thumbnails and uh, my uh, artwork and graphics for social media and for uh, any products that I'm launching. I use a combination of Canva and another software. Uh, but we're going to get back in here. I'm going to do a tutorial on this, but I just want to go show you real quick on uh, Pixelide uh, right here on August 5th, 2021. Uh, it's the last day. It ends in 20 hours right here, 20 hours and 16 minutes. This goes away and look, starting at $59, they do have a few different plans. And look at this, 433 reviews, and they have five tacos. So five-star reviews, 433 reviews. Uh, that is a lot on AppSumo to get, uh, you know, hundreds of reviews means that it's a really good tested software and people are really, really enjoying it. Uh, you can see it's, it is a, um, a direct alternative to Canva and PicMonkey. And they have thousands of different, and there's a video here you can watch. They have thousands of different uh, templates, just like Canva does. And when we scroll down here, and you'll see the interface in a minute, I'll show you that. But I really wanted to show you the what you get in the lifetime access to Pixelide uh, Pro plan. They have a single, double, and multiple versions. Now, the single is $59. You're going to get everything. You're going to be able to use it on five workstations. Now, it is cloud-based, but it will recognize that you're on different machines is what I'm taking this as. So uh, most of us don't aren't going to use it on more than five computers. If you need it just for yourself, you're getting all the features. Uh, you're getting unlimited downloads, unlimited storage, unlimited folders, 3 million plus stock photos, and uh, five work sta stage uh, computers, one team member, and 20 background removal. So this right here is where the separator between the tiers really comes in. Um, you're, I'm not going to really worry too much about workstations, but if you plan on um, having a team member, then you're probably going to have to get at least the double um, tier plan at $118 because you're going to need to be able to give a login access to your virtual assistant that's going to go out and do all the designs for you. And then you're going to get a little bit more background removal. So the only um, downfall is the background removal credits. Um, there must be, that must take a lot of um, power or engine to do those because it usually is one of the highest features on all these softwares where it, you, you usually don't give you unlimited background removals. I noticed that I have an issue sometimes in Canva with mine. I have to do it multiple times in order for it to work. Once it uh, takes the background out and then I try to save the image, then it takes away the background that I actually, you know, uh, removed. So um, I haven't had a whole lot of t uh, chances to um, test that out, but um, just keep in mind, you get limited on that. I usually don't really use more than 20 a month anyways. I'm just usually using it for my thumbnails and things like that. So just keep in mind right there. And uh, and if you, you can have team, uh, 25 workstations, so I really recommend probably the single or double plan on this one. I'm not going to really recommend the multiple because all that's really doing is giving you um, the most background removals, and it's not even increasing your team members anymore. And then you're getting 25 computers. You don't really need, uh, you're not going to really need that. So we come down here and you can just see 
The 433 reviews that you're getting on this, I mean, there's just a ton of reviews. And you can see up here, I actually did a search for Canva and there's over 30 people mentioning that it is a great alternative to Canva. Look, Canva five stars. This means people that are Canva users are using this software and purchased it and they're giving it five stars and they're really happy that they don't have to pay a monthly fee anymore. All right, so let's jump into the software real quick. Um, this is what, uh, when you first log in, you're going to have templates, uh, my designs, workspaces, background remover and illustrations, right? And then you have your account and all that up here and you can create a design from here and you can upgrade as well. They have a monthly plan and the monthly plan is, I believe, let's see over here go to the pricing and they, you can log in for free and test out the software. You can pay yearly and save 30% or it starts at $9.95 a month. Or if you go for an annual plan, $84, you're going to save, uh, you're going to save. And that's actually way cheaper than Canva. Even if you want to pay that way, 156. But if you are interested in this software, it's better to just pick it up right now today. If you're watching the video on August 5th, uh, I just learned about this software today. That's why I'm bringing it to you guys. But you have 20 hours on August 5th. Go ahead and pick it up for $59. And you'll never, never have to pay for it again. You'll get lifetime updates. And so that's cheaper, way cheaper than even an annual plan to their software right here. So it's just a really, really, really good deal. And you'll never have to pay. This is yearly. So someone would have to pay this every single year. If you pick up the app, some deal, you only have to pay uh, one time for the life of the software. So that's why I like these AppSumo deals. I'm going to be bringing a lot more of these to you guys because I know you're going to like these and you only have to pay one time. And if you can find a software that you can use in your business right here uh, and replace uh, monthly memberships, then it's great, right? So we're going to go back into it and you can see over here with templates and you can see they have Facebook uh, posts and Facebook stories. Let's scroll down here. I really like to use a lot of them um, for my YouTube, uh, content marketing is good as well. YouTube end screens, YouTube thumbnails. Look at that. We can click on see more I'm gonna go ahead and just look at some of the YouTube thumbnails and they actually will break it out right there for you. And just look, I think that they actually are a little bit more aesthetically appealing with just the text and the way they do things a little bit more than Canva. I'd give them a little bit of the edge on that. Um, there was one that I really, really liked. I'm going to show it to you in a minute. I mean, just like, look at this one. We click on it and open this one up and look at the crisp of this and look at how nice this looks. And there's like some glow going on around that it just looks super, super nice. And then check this out. I mean, seriously, you can go and start Fiverr gigs and sell these, um, have high quality viral, uh, YouTube thumbnails and just create them in here. Look at this Fortnite thumbnail. You can move this guy around if you want to change the text out, change the background out. But, but look at this thumbnail, the high quality value of these, and they don't have templates like this in Canva. So I think this is where they get an edge. Now I did create one. I'm going to go back up over here, um, back up here and then go to my designs. And I created one. So I'm just going to go ahead and push edit here. Now I created this one based on one of the templates. I just went and found a template, right? And then I changed this out, something that would be something that I would do, right? For my channel, make money in 10 minutes on YouTube for beginners. So, I mean, I changed out the image, right? So I have the image in the background and you can easily just go and change that image out. It looks, uh, uh, it functions a lot like Canva, uh, where you can come over here, you can go to um, images over here and you can type in YouTube push enter and it's getting from um, Unsplash and Pixabay. So you can see I found this image uh, right here and I threw that in there. Uh, you can also go to Pixabay and search uh, Pixabay and get a whole other library of um, thousands of photos here. Now there's some really cool stuff we can do. We can go to um, icons and let's say, let's see if we can find one that is YouTube, if they have YouTube in here. So we have some YouTube stuff in here. So I'm going to grab a YouTube icon. Really, really cool. You can throw that up over here and then you can come over here into elements. And let's just say we were going to put like a little badge over here or something. I'm going to move that over here and bring it up and then we can change the color. I'm going to just make it an orange color and make it bigger. And let's just say we were going to maybe add some text over here, add a headline and just put, um, 
I'm just going to put the number five real quick just to show you um, some different elements that we can we can play with over here, right? And I'm just going to throw that over here. Now, here's another really cool thing you can do. So they have, it, it is very, is, and I'm really glad it's the user interface is set up very similar to Canva and it's very powerful. Um, but, but that's great because it won't be a hard transition for people coming from Canva, right? Now we can come over here and if you ever need to get into any of your files that you uploaded, I uploaded a couple of screenshots here. But here's something that I really like that I don't think Canva offers. You can click on this blend aspect and look, you can quickly change all the colors with these color palettes that they have color palettes here that have colors that go good together, right? And so you can just easily switch out um, all these different colors. It will just completely change everything on, you know, at the same time, which is really, really cool. I'm going to go with that. And then I'm actually going to come back over and there you go. I mean, just look at this, how easy you can change all the colors on your screen. This would make it easy for you to change the colors um, quickly and kind of go with a new a design or just quickly look at different colors. I mean, look at that. It just changes everything. Look at that one. That one really stands out. I mean, that might even be ugly. You might want to change the um, these two colors here, but then this would stand out on, on YouTube, right? So really, really cool stuff. Um, you can come up back up over here into templates, like I said, or you can just come back over here. It'll automatically save for us and you can come back over here and you can search right here for anything that you're looking for. So just really intuitive. Uh, they even have Twitch stuff in here, uh, blog featured image, and you can look at all these different images for, um, for your blog posts, right? So uh, all in all, uh, I really, really like the software. It, um, I'm not really seeing anything in here. Um, I guess the, um, the things that it, I'm not seeing that it has, if you're, if you actually use in Canva, the, the calendar or the scheduler, uh, where, you know, you have a content plan and use the content calendar on Canva. Uh, let's go over there real quick. So here's Canva. And then if you actually use this feature right here, content calendar, we click on that. And some people use this to, in order to, you know, push plus, and then you can actually add something in here and add it to your content calendar. You can do that. Um, they have uh, different uh, folders. You can, add, you can also have your folders in here. You can create folders as well. You just go under uh, my designs and then you add a folder right here and you can just say like online marketing. And there's your new online marketing folder and you can add anything you want, any of your designs to it. So it has that, that's great. But, um, you know, and then they do have something that's similar to a brand kit as well. I'm just kind of trying to do a little bit of a comparison here for you. Um, they do have, where is it at? My designs. So once you're inside of a design, they have this thing called brandify. Now you can add present. So you can actually come in here and once you can put in all your brand colors in here and then you'll be able to just push a button and you'll be able to change all the colors and the fonts and all that. Um, so they do have that, which is really cool. So they have that as well. Um, so really, uh, the only thing I'm seeing missing is that I believe in Canva, when you have a design, you're actually able to go over here to the three dots and you have more sharing features. You can pin it on Pinterest, uh, Twitter, Facebook group, Tumblr. Uh, there's more things you can do over here. You can, um, I believe, schedule it to Pinterest as well. So, uh, but all in all, really, really great software that I'm seeing here at Pixelide. And like I said, if you want to go pick it up, it's uh, it's a really good uh, Canva alternative. And they have a great deal on AppSumo that ends at the end of the day on August 5th. And right now you can see there's 20 minutes in 20 hours and two minutes to go pick this up for $59 uh, one time lifetime fee. So thanks for joining me in this video and I will see you in the next.